Silios had a question, how to set a shortcut for the razor edit icon in Reaper 7. Okay, so I think you are talking about, about this button here in the main toolbar. So you want a, a button that activates that? Pretty sure that that razor tool is actually called a range override B. Okay, so these are the actions. Set a range view override mouse modifiers B. So that turns that on. You can set that until you release it, or you can toggle that. So with the toggle, that will toggle between on and off. So that's probably the one to set. So if you want, want to set that on like the R key or something like that, that will arm that button. Any other buttons, you would use the function called arm next. Uh, arm next action, and that would go in, or toggle arm next action, would go into a, um, a custom action along with the button that you want to press. Hopefully that answers it. You can um, you can always do the alt right drag to do razor edits um, without having to enable this, but this sets it up for the left drag. But it also makes it so that you can't do any other functions while that's active. So that's why I'm not using it too much. I've been using it like maybe twice a week since that was added. Um, I think I maybe use the marquee select once, but usually I'm using the modifier keys. Ash said, I need to unbind everything involving razor edit. Never want that, especially accidental. Interesting. Uh, I've been really liking razor edit for the unique things that it can do, like being able to select multiple envelope lanes, selecting an item and its envelopes, except some and being able to copy and paste that different places or being able to trim multiple envelopes at once. It's not my default for every edit, but it can do some things that can't be done any other way. So I really like that.